Hello everybody and welcome back, well, welcome, actually, to Zone of the Enders, the second runner. I thought about playing this game basically right after the first Zone of the Enders game, but I decided to have a week break just to... No, you don't. No, you... Oh, no, let's select... This game decided it wanted to play its... Seven minute, eight minute entrance video again. <laughs> uh, no. No. Nothing else. Uh, I'm not kidding. This game had a freaking trailer before it. I'm sitting here expecting, oh, a four, four minute video. Kind of showing off the game a little bit, showing off. Yeah, okay, that's cool. And then I'm sitting there at the four, at the five minute mark saying, when is this going to end? And it had several moments to end. I will post it as its own separate video after the playthrough because if I, if I make that part of this, you better not be. Okay, good. This is just the intro. Yeah, that, that was the trailer that I was talking about. This is the intro. It starts off roughly the same, only there's nobody talking right now. But the trailer went seven minutes. And there's just no way I want to put seven minutes of nothingness in this video. At the beginning of the first video. And then... I'd have to go, what? At least 20 minutes, so I'd have a to have at least 15 minutes of gameplay, which I'm not going to have because there's an... This thing. There's an intro video. There's a... Um, you start the game, there's a cutscene the first moment you start. And this thing was freaking vibrating on my leg. By the way, I'm probably going to stay a little bit more quiet in this one because the voice acting and everything's much better. Angie, I remember now. The winner of the year was Hesperia Gales. No idle talk. You'll crash, Dingo. In the final 30 seconds, Henry G trashed out from field out. Man, we had a great time that night. 20 to touchdown. Can't wait for the new season. Position for landing. The people on Mars can start getting excited. I still have 200 more hours. Be a good kid and the time will fly. <laughs> That's unusual. What is? Indications of Metatron, but it's way too shallow. Angie, I want to change the landing point. I'll check it out. Okay. Rick, you hear that? I'll be back soon. Dingo, what team won in 66? I don't know much about back then. Ah. <laughs> Piece of junk. Canceled. Yeah, the lip sync is still kind of off, but of course. Going to win this year. <laughs> there goes your entire salary again. I'm sure of it. Oh, that's ominous. But of course, it's it's still it's a game that was originally with. Oh, the, yeah, this is fun. But, uh, again, this game was originally mostly Japanese voice acted, so it's going to have the Japanese lip sync, especially since it's not in-game animated. It actually looks almost, um, like, drawn as an anime. Also, this thing is freaking slow unless you drop. Unless you jump. Because... Holy crap. This is the walk speed. Just a lovely stroll through... What would you call this? Winter Tundra? I don't know. The stupid thing is slow. Shut up. Unless there's a... Running that I don't know about. There's a sh jump straight up. Why would this thing... Oh, there's also an attack. Technically, I think that's more for drilling. 
Shut up! If it was much faster, I wouldn't be doing this. I will push the lev as hard as I want to because freaking. Dingo's not just gonna reply at all. Ooh, whoops. Oh, probably need to do the actual straight up jump. Guess it's a good thing that I learned about that. Are we there yet? Yes, finally! We can stop walking so slowly now! The Metatron is not very deep. And it's very strong. It wasn't here last time I came. Going back. Going back. Of course. Shut up. <laughs> Is it debris? The observation crews are goofing off again. What the hell is that? Anything wrong? Just big containers and then interesting. I'll check it out. Sitting down in the middle of nowhere. I do, I do really like the drawn anime cutscenes. Instead of using like the in-game models like they did last time, because in in-game models last time sucked. Holy crap. What's happening, Angie? What ship did you see? Ah! Angie! Damn. A warship? It must be Bara. And... That's a big ship. Oh, and a lot of raptors. Great. And there goes your ride. My liver's damaged. Damn Barum. Barum from Mars? How can you tell? Get your ship down into the ditch and stay hidden. Here we go! Now that my hands are numb from frickin' the controller vibrating so much, that whole time, anything would happen. Controller would start vibrating and it's... <laughs> made my... Really? An achievement already? Oh, thank you for that, um, late warning. As you can tell, everything's a lot... As, well, not a lot faster, but it... Everything's moving quite faster. And it does look a little bit nicer. There's a lot better glow effect. Confirming the enemy destroyed. What is the efficiency of this frame? This is orbital frame Jehuti. Do you want me to explain how to manipulate the frame? Who is this? This is detached backup battle unit, Ada. So this is a battle computer, isn't it? More reliable than the Lev's navigators. I'm completely different. Do you request control instructions? Yes, Ada. Please. No, Ada. I, I, I don't really care, but the one thing I think... Let's see. Guard. Let's see what lock-on is. Oh. Never mind, never mind, never mind. Skip. And then... Okay, if I remember correctly... Yep, just the left trigger, okay. 
I'm good. I thought there was something different. But, since I was completely wrong, I'm gonna go back to the actual playing. Roger. Departing for zero four. No goody. Enemy approaching. Unmanned battle planes. <sighs> Unmanned combat aircraft. The mosquito. Individual attacks are weak. But be careful. Okay, this is what I was trying to figure out. Now in this game, if you hold down the attack button, he can lock on. You can lock onto multiple targets and fire, and it will attack all those targets. So instead of having to deal with every single one of these one at a time, I can take out 20, 30, 40 of them. Probably also help if I moved the camera around a little bit. Holy crap, how many more are there? Then I was pretty efficient in killing them. I think that should be the last one. There we go. Yes, I'll connect you now. Help me, Dingo! Where are you? My legs are damaged. Rick, where are you now? Ah! Don't move! I'll be there soon! Enemy approaching. That was a little just bad, but I mean, <laughs> voice acting can't be perfect. Still gonna make fun of whenever I hear bad voice acting, it's just gonna be a thing. Back to the vibrating! Oh goody, more. Let's get rid of these guys. I don't think I can charge that yet. Hmm. Oh! And you're actually kind of difficult. You're already a level 3. I forgot about that. No, switch over to the frickin'... Switch over to the raptor. The frick... Yes, thank you. Now let's deal with all these guys. Just keep firing. It's just a lot easier just to... Hope that you get all of them. I want to test something real quick, though. Well, that worked out. I think it does work. Hold on. Yes, it does charge. Cool. Okay. I didn't know if that happened yet or if it happened after it got got an upgrade or anything. But no, that's awesome. I already sent a level 3 raptors after me. That's going to be pain. Yes, I got that. I want to find the other raptor first. It's right in front of you. Thank you. And charge a little bit more. Yeah, they definitely did a lot of good things with the systems in this game. Especially with the being able to multi-target with the with all the lasers with the uh, barrage of lasers and also the charging of the ball attack is a pretty nice addition too because it just gives you a really strong long range attack without needing any sub weapons even though the <laughs> even though the energy ball was probably the best long range attack anyways I want to say, I it's been a little while since I've actually played this game, but I want to say they did get better with the sub-weapons. Oh, hello. Didn't expect to see you already. Can I get some Metatron so I don't die? Yeah, I got that. I'm basically gonna die at this rate because look at how many freaking got 15 raptors on me. Yeah, this is why I shouldn't have chosen hard. Ah, uh, there it is. 
Goody! Dingo? Help me out! Dingo! Let's try to run backwards a little bit. Just to give myself a little bit of room. You know, I... that... Little. You know, you telling me how to lock on kind of gets rid of the whole need for a tutorial section right beforehand. If you're just gonna tell me, press this button to do this thing, then why even have that whole tutorial map, or that tutorial menu set up? Are all the raptors gone? Nope, there's still one more, but I think I can deal with it pretty simply. Stay right there. Gotcha! The ball attack now is amazing. So much more useful than it used to be. And it was pretty useful beforehand. The only problem now is I don't know if I can pause and save if I need to. Because like last time, I don't want to run too long with these videos. Can I save anywhere? Awesome. That's a good thing to know. But, let's see. Oh, it also, it actually shows level up and experience and all that that you need. Cool. I'm not going to end it now because I want to get through this first part at least. <clears throat> because I don't like... I don't like starting off a game and then not getting to a decent stopping part. And ending a video in between this hectic moment. I don't like cliffhangers that much. You can block all you want to. Which I need to remember I... What button is it? Oh, cool! You give me Metatron now! Okay, it's right bumper. The cursor is on. Destroy with a burst attack. Thank you. Again, why do you even have... Oh, it's not even there. Why do you even have that tutorial at the beginning if you're going to tell me what to do? Let's see how much more my controller vibrates. Let's see if I can get my foot to go numb. <laughs> Beat it, Rick. That's pretty fancy. I need to remember that I have a shield now. I think you do have a guard in the last game, it's just not as useful as it is in this game. Focus on me, you jerk! Don't attack the person that's not in or orbital frame. Since I found Jay with you, you'll have to give it to me. What does Barra want with Callisto? Oh, you don't look like a mining man to me. Get lost. Okay, that is the weirdest. I forget. <laughs> that is the weirdest yell ever. Oh wow, she has um. What's it called that we had last time? That ability. Yeah, cool. Thank you for that, Ada. Uh, that's what I was trying to do. I don't like getting shot at. And don't like getting hit. So, I was trying to shoot down her, her attack with lasers. It just wasn't working. I need to remember that I have that. Again. Thank you for... Okay, seriously. I hate whenever attacks stun me so long that I can't get moving again. Got her. There we go. You want to, whenever she does that, whenever she does that multiple attack, you want to run and then try to shoot him down. You also want to, whenever she pulls it back, she's vulnerable at that moment. Right now, go. And then, ah, she ran away. 
She's supposed to be- she's normally vulnerable at that moment. Can I- nope. Yeah, but as you can tell, they did a lot of work with the, like, effects around the, the, um, orbital frames. Like, different glows and, like, whooshing lines to make it look like you're going fast. Stop with the guarding, you're getting on my nerves. Oh, crap. Oh, uh, craps. Do not get near her! Oh, well, it was a laser beam anyways. Get back here! We're close to about the same health. You just have a little bit more than me right now. Fire, just... I think it's easier to... Uh... This, this move is annoying. But at least we're close to the same right now. I might be able to pull this out. Oh crap, laser beams again. She's charging up something and then she's gonna shoot her laser again. Go at her. Got her. I don't know if that's gonna... Nah, of course she's gonna get back into her guarding again. But at least I have some sort of chance here. Until she activates this thing again. I cannot really dodge this that well. Thank you, game. Fantastic. Thank you. <sighs> Mission completed. For now, I'll take Jehuti and go back to the base. There's no hope anymore. Okay, so I kind of figured out what I need to do with the... With her homing attack. And what it was not allowing me to do a little... Well, no, it was my fault. I should have done it beforehand. I just wasn't thinking about it. Is you need to lock on. You need to switch the lock on from her to the bits that she's firing. Like so. And just start firing and kind of turning to one side or the other. To hope that they kind of clump together. That should be about... There we go. But you needed to lock on and move left or right and hope that they clump together to where you can shoot more than once at one time. Don't you? Maybe. Even if you're bar off, that's too rough. It sure is. Who's the commander? You think I'll tell? Are you alright? Yeah! Dingo! The enemy is approaching me! Alright, I'll try to head them off. You will? Take care, Angie. What? Thinking you're gonna do some suicide mission? Inside enemy battleship. Entry is dangerous. If we don't do something, we'll be crushed along with Callisto. We have no choice. Probably right, but I need to hopefully have a good place to pause and save, right? No more cutscenes? No more talking? My luck, I have to probably s <laughs> probably need to destroy these things before I can save. Which if I remember correctly, these things aren't too bad. Now let me get rid of these guys first. Yeah, something I should be trying to do. Where's the third one? Oh, never mind. Crap. Allow me to frickin' breathe for five seconds. And... Okay, that did not work as well. They've updated the grab system, too. You're able to actually grab and, if I remember correctly, get over... You jerk, I was grabbing you. They just allow everything to gang up on you way too easily. Come on, at least give me a break. Okay, good. 
Is there any Metatron? No, it doesn't look like it. But they updated the grab system. You can actually grab and use the enemy as a weapon or throw them at other enemies to make them... Like, you can actually spin them around and do extra damage and throw them at other enemies to do even more damage to both. But I'm going to save right now before I die. And... Okay, that was a pretty hectic moment. <laughs> anyway, I hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, please give it a like and subscribe, and I will see you guys next time.